Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google Account Lock security feature on an Android device, also known as the FRP Lock for factory reset protection. Now, here with us today, we have a Samsung Galaxy Tab A9 Plus, and it's a cellular model, so they throw 5G on the end of that for a, for a super long device name. But this device does have the Google account lock enabled because as we can see here, as we're going through the initial setup steps, we get to the screen that tells us that the tablet was factory reset. And to continue, we have to either verify the previous screen pin code that was used, or if we tap on use my Google account instead, it'll pull up this other option that tells us that we can also sign in with the previous Google account that was used on the device. So over the years, we've been contacted by tons of customers asking us for assistance with this specific issue on this specific model, usually either because they themselves accidentally got locked out of their own device and couldn't remember or recover their login information after having done a factory reset, or unfortunately, a lot of times these days, someone will buy a used device from the internet off of someone who winds up being a scammer. So the seller did not tell the buyer that the device was locked, and then after the purchase, the buyer discovers the lock, and obviously they're not going to have any of the previous user's login information, and the seller in that case has usually long since disappeared with a fraudulent transaction. But we're making this video here today to show any interested customers that we do offer a service to be able to get the lock removed from this model without having to have the previous user's login information. The removal process is something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. You would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast and stable internet connection. And we can remotely connect right to your computer through the internet to perform the exact same procedure that we've done here on this one. So actually, as I've been speaking, I've been running our unlock program here on the device while it's been plugged in. <clears throat> that goes ahead and takes care of that lock for us. Now that it's all finished up and the device is restarting, we should be able to see that we can get all the way through all of the initial setup steps without running into that Google lock page. So just hold on here for a moment while it finishes rebooting. All right, so we should be all set to go here. We're gonna begin by hitting start. And then we have to agree to the terms and conditions. And we're not gonna set up from another device. We are going to skip ahead from Wi-Fi. And now wait while it does some more setting up here. We do not need to copy any apps and data, so we're going to skip that step. And now this is the page where the Google lock would have normally shown up before, but you'll notice the wording has now changed. So instead of previous requiring the previous account that was on the device, it actually now just says sign in with your account, meaning that we can sign in with any account, and it even gives us the option to create a new one if we want to. We don't need an account actually on the device though, so we're just going to go ahead and skip that, just so we can get through all of the rest of the setup steps as fast as possible. All right, there we go. So we've got the home screen loading up here. We have full access to all of the apps and settings and features, 
and this is just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. While we're here, I'm gonna pop over into the settings and show you exactly what we're working with. So in the settings, when we go down to About Tablet, we can indeed see that we have a Tab A9 Plus 5G, and then that model number there, the SMX218U, that's the model number of basically all of the US carrier models of the Tab A9 Plus. So if you have a Tab A9 Plus with the FRP lock enabled and need help getting it removed, we would love to assist you with that, so go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information can be found right down in the video description, and we'll also put a slide at the end of the video that has all of our contact details there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for thousands of models of mobile devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Hitting that subscribe button while you're there will enable you to be notified of all of the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like we're doing here with this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes también nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks so much for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.